I don't know whether these peep show is run by their government or the exhibition, but it is clear to everybody that do know anything about cow pits, that is bound to give spectators a false idea of the conditions in which the miner must work in order to earn his miserable wages. This year entertainment is what a coal pit might be like if it were worked under ideal conditions, and I should like it explained why they don't tell you so, instead of letting I go back to your woes to tell everybody the miner's got nothing to grumble at. And he who's talking to know what tis to work in foul air and up to his waist in water and have his lamp go out through the bad air and have to grope his way over a mile to the pit mouth through places scarce big enough to crawl through to strike a match that a meant being blowed of litters. I've a seen me vast path pinned down by a stone from the roof weighing several tons and I've had to watch him slope die because the road weren't big enough to use levers big enough to move the stone. Then we've had to use explosives before we could get the body out. Where's your shoots or guns down here? Shoots not much bigger than a chimney, and I'm all so steep. Shoots what to get choked up me call halfway up through big nubs itching in the supporting timbers. Shoots that you gotta climb up to where a call is caught and put boards in the timbers above your head and then hang on with your knees in one hand while you'd a scratch with t'other hand of a choked coal, draw a hole you the left in the boards and let it run on down to your mates below. And up there in pitch blackness you'd a go on scratching at the coal and swaller in the bad air and the mouth bows of dust until all the coal is gone down past thee. If the boards don't happen to break rust and send ye to the bottom to be crushed and buried alive. The last mate I pulled out on a shoot, he had tried to unbash, for still kicking when we bound his left boot, but there was so much coal all around him and were wedged so tight that twere another hour afore we got his dead body out. I could keep on for hours about the dangers and the conditions of a miner's life. And when I'd a look round and see this your gentleman's wine setter, they got the sauce to call a coal mine, and make I itch for a packet of that there stuff the pit fireman to use. <laughs>